So as HP, we have always been a big proponent of open source and open source communities. Our investment in open source started from the early Linux days. With Cloud Foundry, we plan to extend the same uh, philosophy and the same principles by contributing the, the work and the innovations done back to the community uh, into the Cloud Foundry space. Recently, we announced support for .NET uh, within Cloud Foundry, and we made that contribution available to the community. And that is just the first step of many that we will be doing to take the foundation forward and closer to where it actually meets the needs of all our enterprise customers. Our customers are looking for a platform that is open. Uh, it's open source, built around open technologies, and doesn't have a lock-in. Customers are also looking for a platform that is flexible, portable, and enables the, uh, the, the notion of a hybrid cloud. And finally, and most importantly, Customers are looking for a solution that is composable and offers them and their developers a wide range of choices. It gives them the flexibility to use the tools and frameworks they need to do their job. So the flexibility of Cloud Foundry, the openness of Cloud Foundry, and the range of choices it offers to customers makes Cloud Foundry a natural choice for us. Intrinsic to Cloud Foundry uh, is the notion of microservices. And as the world transitions towards cloud native and cloud native applications, the model that uh, Cloud Foundry innately supports uh, aids the developer into making this transition to the world of uh, writing cloud native applications. Cloud Foundry has grown leaps and bounds uh, since the foundation came to be. Uh, what we are excited about and what we are you know, hoping the foundation is going to accomplish is the creation of a wide variety of applications and tools and ut utilities and an ecosystem that makes Cloud Foundry the choicest of platforms for the enterprise. Cloud Foundry has arrived. Uh, enterprises, uh, customers, the vendors who were at the summit, the ecosystem uh, is beginning to happen. It's growing leaps and bounds and very excited about it.